A lot of people don't think about what happens after they run their shower or flush their toilet or discharge anything into their waste stream. Once it's gone, it's gone. The reality is that it's an important business in any municipality to process our wastewater. It needs to go somewhere. Every wastewater treatment plant is a necessity to the cities that it serves. We just assume that whatever the energy cost is, it is because we need it. The city of Thousand Oaks, they took a very different approach. Uh, they wanted it not only to be cost efficient, but they wanted it to be environmentally efficient as well. Hill Canyon Wastewater Treatment Plant serves the city of Thousand Oaks, California. It sits at the end of Santa Rosa County Park it is an incredibly environmentally sensitive area. Come on in, Chris, I'll show you around. Cogeneration is using a single source of fuel to produce multiple forms of energy. We're taking as much heat from the exhaust and the engine cooling system as possible and putting it back into a plant, into a process, into space heating requirements, whatever the case may be. And ultimately, you're displacing all that energy from the grid. So it's highly, highly efficient. The difference in cogeneration using biogas, like Hill Canyon did, from traditional cogeneration in traditional cogeneration, you still have to purchase the natural gas from the utility. The great thing about what Hill Canyon is doing is they are extracting the biogas from the waste that they treat. So they basically have free or very low cost fuel and it makes it that much more efficient, more sustainable output. So our gas uh, comes into the building over here, Chris, and then down through the fuel train into the engine. It's really important to have a, an engine that's specific to biogas because biogas is a pretty harsh gas. It contains a number of contaminants that can be very damaging to those engines. So there's a lot that has to be considered when, when you're developing an engine for this type of fuel. We need to make sure that we design the engine in a way, not only that it's able to have a tolerance for some of these things that might make it through the, the gas stream, but also it's gonna run constantly, 24 seven, almost every day of the year. So this engine's really purpose built to run a long time and in very demanding and very difficult environments. This plant is 100% sustainable. It generates all its own electricity. Their waste product has a tremendous amount of potential energy that we can use. By capturing that and by putting that in our digesters along with the residential waste, we create a tremendous amount of energy. If you look at the carbon footprint of what this plant is versus what a plant that was taking all of their energy off the grid, you realize that the amount of carbon that we offset here, that we don't burn, that we don't use, is the equivalent of, of over a thousand acres of forest every year being planted. We've transformed this facility from a wastewater treatment plant to a wastewater treatment plant that produces its own power. If they all adopted this technology, that's the equivalent of pulling 500,000 vehicles off the road. So there's tremendous potential in this industry for successful companies that can help do what was done at Hill Canyon.